सो हे एवरी वन वेलकम बैक टू चैनल टेक एंड आर्ट होप यू गाइज डूइंग गुड सो टूडे वी विल डिस्कस अबाउट द सीक्वल सर्वर क्वारी स्टोर यूटिलाइजेशन हाउ वी कैन यूटिलाइज द सीक्वल सर्वर क्वारी स्टोर एंड विल गेट द बेनिफिट सो बिफोर स्टार्टिंग द सेशन ईच एंड एवरी वन हुएवर न्यूली ज्वाइन चैनल प्लीज लाइक टू सब्सक्राइब प्लीज विजिट द चैनल प्ले लिस्ट सीक्वल सर्वर डी बी ए मोर देन वन फिफ्टी वीडियोज ऑन अ रियल टाइम बेस्ड सीनारियो बेस्ड videos if you are getting help please like to subscribe and don't forget to share with others please buy the channel membership if you interested okay and also share the you know super thanks so let me start the session today so today session is all about how we can you know uh, utilize the sql server query store as we know sql server query store introduced in sql server 2016 onwards okay so let me show you where it is actually once you connect the sql server management studio if you go to your database if your query store is enabled okay so you can see here the query store okay so if you go to query stores there are three major components which you need to focus here okay first is request query second is overall resource consumption and third is top resource consuming query so i am going one by one uh, let's see so once you right click the uh, you know request query you can see the view request query let me open the second one also overall resource consumption and the top resource okay so all three is opened here you can see here i am in the you know uh, dashboard of you know top resource consumption query of sql server uh, db my my db okay so you can see here the bar okay if you go to the bar it will take you the you know uh, the query plan and all so in a below you can see here all the execution plan you can see here and you can do the analysis for the particular query execution plan you can see and you can extract this query if you want to you know save this execution plan you can save it you, if you want to so in xml you can do from the xml from here if any recommendation uh will be for this query it will be showing here if any any index required to you know uh, create it will show here once you click on any bar so here uh, i want to explain some things if you want to you know so the you know the table method here we have a two option in a view so either in a bar or you can see here the grid format okay so whatever the top consumption query it will show here in a grid format so basically we want to use the bar so once you click on a bar it will show you the this bar uh, all execution plan on a below and here you can see you know the query plan so here in my system it's a lab system not usable okay so that's the reason i am not seeing here actually much plan else in your live environment you can see the so many plan here if any plan is changing here you can analyze based on that okay and it is a recommendation don't put any force plan on your production database okay which means the query which change the plan that is not beneficial and you are forcing them ki okay boss you now you use this plan this is beneficial so you cannot go blindly and do it without any an analysis okay so don't put on this force plan do more analysis then only go with this force plan okay now the, if you want to take this query from here you can simply click on uh, this it will take you here in a sql server in my studio and you can take this query and share to the application owner and discuss with them the boss this query is taking too much you know resource consumption and i am getting the index recommendation also whatever blah blah if any index recommendation it will come here okay if you see the any execution plan query execution plan the index cost is much higher and if you see any you know a table scan is happening okay then you can see you can check with the you know uh, application owner for any recommendation of index okay similarly uh, so here all plan all the top you know resource consumption plan will show you so once you click on a bar each bar it will take you the 
different different execution plans so similarly the overall resource consumption it's not coming here for in my system because it's a you know lab so not usable so similarly the bar will come here for the top you know uh, for this duration of query and it will show you the you know how many times it's executed in a last few minutes or whatever the time duration uh, execution count will come here here you will see the you know the top cpu of that particular query xyz query is taking how much cpus during that time frame and the logical reads also you can see here okay so this is for the overall resource consumption okay and third is this is very very important the regressed query okay so if any regressed query which is taking too high in terms of you know uh, io or cpu so you can find it here if any recommendation the same thing it will come on a below you know uh, the query execution plan and here you will see the you know uh, the execution plan if you want to change the execution plan so you can go with the force plan so again the force plan you cannot go blindly until unless you have the fully recommendation okay so these are the main three major setting which you know you need to track or you need to you know uh, do the regular analysis of your critical database server okay if you are getting any high cpu alert and high memory alert easily you can come to here in a query store and you can see what particular query is causing issue and what are the recommendation for that okay and you can share to the application owner if any recommendation for that particular query if index is taking too high so you can check whether your index maintenance jobs are running fine or not okay update stats running fine or not you know so uh, those all uh, maintenance jobs also you need to check it by seeing this analysis okay so well that's it for today hope you got the point what i'm trying to say okay, how we can utilize this beautiful tool query store and we'll get the be, uh, you know better analysis on that performance tuning well that's it for today we'll meet you soon guys till then bye bye thank